I'm Emily Atak, and today we're going to be previewing some of the categories for the 2020 Virgin Media BAFTAs. It was happy slash sad news for lovers of Catastrophe, where we saw the final series of the show written by Sharon Horgan and Rob Delaney. Another powerhouse performance from these two, and a much-loved series that we hope one day might come back. Writer Lisa McGee's Dairy Girls has, for its second series, continued to be just an exploding bomb of delight following a group of friends during the Northern Irish Troubles. What is it? I don't know. I am a Dairy Girl! They did such a great job and long may Dairy Girls continue. In recent years, the BAFTAs have basically turned into the Phoebe Waller Bridge Awards, and this year looks like to be no exception, with Fleabag coming back for a second series, which was centred around a love story between Fleabag and the hot priest. I don't think there was a moment in Fleabag that I didn't believe or didn't love. I need to tell you to watch Staff Let's Flats. I feel that this was one of the undiscovered gems of 2019-2020. I can spend a lot of my time saying things like, but I haven't even had an egg for energy. It's such a unique character that he plays. You love him, you're irritated by him, but you want to give him a hug. Everyone likes to think they're the greatest dancer, but this year the BBC made it official. You had to enter this competition to win and prove that you really were the greatest dancer. Fantastic show, uh, real Saturday night entertainment format as well, some fantastic judges. The Rap Game UK was such a fantastic concept. It was a more cooler version, I suppose, of, of the X Factor, but for rap. So you've got contestants, you know, rap battling each other. Uh, trying to ultimately get a record deal with Krebs and Conan. Um, and it was such a, it was actually really raw. Strictly is uh, obviously such a huge favourite to everybody. I have been very lucky to be part of the Strictly team myself, uh, working on It Takes Two. Um, and it's so lovely to, to see the show just go from strength to strength to strength. I have to admit, I sort of practice on my own, my own Strictly routines in my kitchen, especially through lockdown. Who has not played the voice at home? You sit on a chair with your back to your friend and they sing really badly whilst you refuse to turn your chair around and they scream, turn your chair, turn your chair. <laughs> I always, I always wonder, oh, if I was on it, would they turn for me? I think that's what we all think, like, oh, would they turn for me? So that's it for today. Come back tomorrow for more ahead of the 2020 Virgin Media BAFTAs. Bye. Take care, everyone. See you soon. Okay, bye, bye, bye. This is always awkward. Don't know what to press.